what is going on guys wwe 2k24 this is a short list of improvements that are now in wwe 2k24 one of them is when you do backstage brawls you can now select exactly where you start at in the backstage brawl Another improvement to WWE 2K24 is when you do backstage brawls, you can now do more than one person. You can do up to four. Now this, you can either do a tornado tag match or a four-way, you know, a four-way match. And in this match here, when someone is illuminated, if you turn illumination on, that wrestler will just lay in the background unconscious and rather than just leave so that is another really good improvement to wwe 2k24 and as you can see aj styles is illuminated so he's just gonna lay there in the background he is not gonna get back up that is a really cool touch to this game it just makes the backstage brawl that much more dramatic if you want to create this effect of just a backstage fight with two on two or or four you know every man for himself in a four way and look just take a look he just land back there he's not gonna ever get back up he's really just part of the background at this point and i personally am a huge fan of this this uh feature i think it's incredibly awesome because it just makes the whole scenario that much more dramatic another cool feature is in previous wwe in the last couple when you had a female outside ring manager you could not and you were a male wrestler you couldn't face her and you know what i mean like you couldn't face her the way you could face the referee or any opponent how you can switch people who you are actually facing you could not do that if it was a female manager and that was just to avoid any any uh, assaults on the females but I'm gonna show you something you now can as you can see you can face her but when you do an attack command a, an attack you can't actually hit her you can just face her kind of just bother the person and the person will actually walk away from you as you can see, I'm facing her now. They will actually let you face them, which is definitely a cool touch because I thought it was silly how you just couldn't even look at them. I thought it was a little bit too much. So, yes, they added that to the game, which is very Another cool feature is the improvements to image, image creator. Of course, they added crowd signs for your wrestlers. You can add those to either real wrestlers or created wrestlers. Give them their own sign rather than those generic ones but under image creator there's a lot of improvements like first of all they added lettering in previous versions you couldn't put letters in there i've always wondered i've always thought that was odd and i just didn't think it made sense this is a lot better for if you want to put letters on different groups that you create you don't have to always constantly retype it every time you're adding that image but then there's also this here where you can kind of create patterns by going to tiling and then going to up and down left and right on the d-pad to kind of adjust the currency or frequency of the pattern and it you can even go pretty extreme with it and make it where you can't even really even really even see the image anymore but this is really cool this feature has always been in creating an arena and stuff like that but it's they did just didn't have it in an image creator and of course you can take these and add them to your crowd signs if you want to kind of do a copy and paste and you know I'm gonna give you an example of that because I created some crowd signs here let's take a look at some of the ones that I've already made the Panteros if you're familiar with the Panteros from Saints Row I have them in this game I have a group with the Pantero's name they use the logo and they you know they're kind of like a heel group and I created the logo 
on the image creator, but then I also attached it to a crowd sign. And then I also attached that to, and this is an uploaded image. It's not something I created, obviously. I think a lot of people can figure that out. But my point is, I can use that same thing as a crowd sign. I can attach it to clothes, even arena if I want to. But so this feature has really improved the game from a standpoint maybe not gameplay but from the standpoint of customization they just took it to another level right now and i believe crowd sign creation was in an older version of w of a wwe game i don't know if it was the 2k series but i kind of remember something from a long time ago anyway that's this video those are a few pretty cool small but to me in a way big improvements to this game because it just increases the the fun factor and enjoyability and range of the game